already bored. He kind of seems like he really hates his job. Like last time he was like, I hope we don't find anything. And now he's just complaining about a main component of their job. Anyway, eventually they see this spooky thing and then they go to check it out and they go in a room and they're like, hey, are you okay? But then the person in the dress turns around and it's not her, it's this guy. And then they run into the bathroom and the girl's in there wearing a different outfit and they grab her and they run out of the house. And that's the end of the video. They didn't catch the thing. They're still working to identify who that man was, they didn't figure out what he wanted, but they did let it attack her while they hid in the car. Actually, I don't know if attack is the right word, because I don't really even know what he did. Like, I guess he just put on her dress and stood in her room and put her in the bathroom. Like, what was his plan? What did he even do? This one's probably my favorite one. Dolphin man found in her house. Mmm, dolphin man. My favorite superhero. For this episode, we received an email from a girl who believes someone or something has been living in one of her family's properties. Her name is Bernice, and her family owns a few houses. Hello, guys. My name is George, and I like to pee pee on the boat. I mean, that's the reason I clicked on the 